So, Anaria, what we know thus far about the game. So, first off, it's going to be 80 players. Now, 80 players, that doesn't seem like a lot, but when you figure out how big the map is going to be, 80 players is a lot because I'm here to tell you they are going to have 80 people crammed into an area the size not much bigger than PV. I will show you how big the map is actually going to be. So it's going to be a three by three map as I'm showing on screen here. This is the H1Z1 map. This is pre before they did all the changes to it and everything. So if you remember the trailer park that was beside of Ranchito, that's in the top right. You see in the top left, that is the army base that is outside of the shopping center. The shopping center is obviously top middle and then that's PV to the edge of it at the bottom. So PV to the shopping center, to the edge of Ranchito, to where the army base is west of the shopping center. That is how big this map is gonna be. It's a three by three map. H1Z1 was an eight by eight map. Excuse me, H1 is actually a 10 by 10 map. So H1 had like, what, 175 players back in the day on a 10 by 10 map, and now this is an 80 by, or I mean a three by three map with 80 people in it. That is a lot of people crammed into a very small map. Now it can't obviously change. They did say that they could lower the player count if that is too hectic. But if you remember the islands of nine map was extremely small i don't remember the spec like they i can't find anything about the specs of islands of nine map how big it was or whatever but it did have 50 people in that really small map but it didn't really play that bad i mean there really was never any hectic you know starts i always kind of landed by myself unless it was a very hot spot so it, it will be interesting to see how 80 people play out in a three by three map i just really wish that i could find the specs on the islands of nine map to actually know how big it is if anybody knows what it is i will uh, pin your comment in the comments if you do find it just leave it down in the comments. Now they obviously said that there will be no vehicles. There will not be a quad, will not be a Jeep, anything like that. There will be no cars whatsoever. So you can't drive around and just get kills. But obviously in a three by three map, I feel like the game will end extremely fast and you really won't have a need for a car to get across the three by three area. Moving on to the guns, I wanted to actually uh, get a read on what the sniper was like and if it was in a crate or on the ground. And the sniper, I've already seen gameplay of it. Obviously a lot of people haven't, but it it is third person a lot of people already know that if you didn't know that the sniper is third person like it was back in the z1 days it is not aiming through the scope but what's interesting and i just found this out today is that the sniper does not drop in a crate and an air crate like h1 did it's actually just spawned into the loot pool on the ground so there will be a like a sniper just laying around on the ground which is interesting obviously if the sniper is a one hit to the head like h1 then that concerns me because then everyone will just be able to pick up a one hit to the head weapon and that's kind of op now the next thing that a lot of people have asked me about and i get all the time is when the release date is and i will just tell you guys straight out i don't really know much more than you guys know and i don't even think the devs know a release date because they've had a lot of issues with these servers and stuff they said they were having a lot of bugs and obviously i would much rather them work those out than it to be there on release because we saw how islands of nine ended in like two seconds because they had the horrible horrible servers on release day i watched doc and shroud play and they were literally freezing in place and their game was crashing and that was a gg for like three years of development now i have already been told by one of the uh you know mods of the discord that the trailer will release this week so they will be releasing the full trailer this week i'm making this video on a tuesday posting it on tuesday and i would assume before Friday, Saturday, that's when you'll see the trailer. Hopefully it will be before Friday because Friday I'm going out of town for three days and I won't even be able to make YouTube videos or get to really, you know, talk about anything in general. Realistically, I would expect the game the first week of August, but that's just me saying that. I haven't been told that by anybody. That's not like a dev has told me that or anything, but you know, at the earliest, the 31st is probably when it would be out, but I can't really see it being out by the 31st if they're having server issues. And I know everybody gets upset like, oh my God, there's a delay. Oh my God, I spent $15 on this game and I can't even play the game. Oh my God. Like if you have spent money on the game and you want the game to actually be playable and be good, then have some patience. I played Islands of Nine for 700 hours before it ever released. I just want you guys to know this. I played 700 hours of Islands of Nine before it released. I signed to an org before it released. I played in the Invitational before it released. I had everything going for me in Islands of Nine, and it died within like an hour of it being released. So if you guys want a game to be good, and you want to talk to me about being frustrated, you can talk to me about being frustrated about a game. And just to add to on top of that frustration, I had an Islands of Nine Invitational AK that I got offered $400 for that it literally was account bound and I never got any money out of it. So little Billy, if you want to be uh, upset because you bought the game like last month and paid $15 for it and it's not out this month, I really don't want to hear it. 
I bought this game like the second that it was purchasable and a lot of people bought it like a year or plus more back when it was actually not even known by most of us. I understand the game market is doo-doo. I mean, every game sucks. Like I've said in every single one of my videos, try to have some patience and try to act like a adult. But telling some of the H1 community to act like an adult is like setting a steak in front of a tiger and telling them not to eat it. On that note, that's all I got for you. The trailer's releasing this week. Sniper spawned into the loot pool. 80 player lobbies in 3x3 map. Very small map. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. Like I said, leave me in the comments if you know how big the Islands of Nine map was because I do not and I can't find anything about it. But hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to leave a like. Go subscribe. I would really appreciate it and I'll talk to you in the next one. Peace.